She has one of the busiest schedules I've ever seen. She's consistently on the run, yet her measurements are still 192-59-50. Those measurements belong to the Goodyear Blimp Enterprise, 192 feet long, 59 feet high, and 50 feet wide. She graced the skies in this area over the weekend at the Appleton Air Show, one of the many events she will be at this summer. She's already been at the Detroit Grand Prix, Indy 500, and she'll be at the baseball all-star game next month in Chicago. The five pilots that fly the Enterprise end up getting to see all the events free. But then again, they aren't really in the stadium. We have plenty of time to watch the event. Football, you can see the, uh, it's like watching the coach's blackboard. You can see the offense and the defense develop. You can't really tell who has the football. Events like uh, the Indy 500 or the Detroit Grand Prix, events we did in the last month, you have perhaps the best seat in the house. The Enterprise is one of four airships Goodyear owns. The 202,700 cubic feet of helium hold a ship anywhere between 500 and 3,500 feet in the air and she clips along at 35 miles an hour. Not as fast as, say, a jumbo jet, but then again, these pilots wouldn't have it any other way. I guess it'd be like a cloud. It's just, it just moves very effortlessly. It's, um, it's a very smooth ride. Um, it's the only type of aircraft that doesn't require seat belts. Um, it's just a very leisurely way of flying. The sights over Appleton were fantastic. And in addition, on this flight, Mike Fitzpatrick gave me the controls. was by far the slowest aircraft I've ever flown, but a flight I would never forget. Like all of them, though, it had to have an ending, so it was back to the airport.